There we go. As you can guess it, I have a new project to feature today. It's a promotional project, and it is appropriately called Superman Coin. We're talking about the superhero here, not based on any Eminem in any way. Hope you just like that intro there, one of my favorite songs. So check out the project, supermancoin.finance. That's the website. Links will be at the bottom. So obviously, it's a meme coin. It's the superhero right here, which I don't think there have been any other meme coins based on. So, Or if they have been, they haven't been successful. So I kind of like this straight off the bat. Let's go to the about section. Here's the here's the they describe the coin. Are you tired of the endless dog and frog memes? Tired of the blank Pepe tokens or blank Pepe coins? Well, frogs have had their run, and it's time for the most popular fictional character to take his place as the king of memes. I can't argue that Superman probably is the number one animated character, superhero character, even more so than Mickey Mouse, uh, probably of all time. So, you know, that bodes well for this project. Superman will be using his heat vision to burn down supply and make this the most popular and most successful meme token on the market. Yes, Superman can create fires. He can burn out fires. Ties right in with token burns. SCP token, Superman token, is being launched by the team at Krypton Calls Investor. So, you know, it's, it's a meme coin. It's based on a great character. Who doesn't like this? But a few things are a little bit different about this project project than the other new meme coins I covered. Number one, there's a bigger NFT element, more on that in a little bit. Number two, there's a bigger DeFi element, more on that. Number three, the biggest team was ties in with what I just said right there. The biggest thing, the team is fully doxxed right here. That is pretty cool for a new meme coin project. Very rare. Here are the three or four team members right here. So let's see, Sean, looks like he comes from a real estate background right here. Mike, he comes from an IT and then background. He's also the DeFi expert. And these two run a uh, influencer, a YouTube channel called Krypton Calls Investing. Here it is. I wasn't too familiar. I'd heard of them. I wasn't too familiar with the kind of content they cover. But here we go. They got their, you know, Superman token review, a bunch of other videos, 11,000 subscribers, 200 videos. Looks like they've been around about as long as I've been around, about a year. So it's pretty good. Very impressive. Who else is on the team? Then we have uh, Paul and then Joe. So Paul comes from engineering background. He looks like kind of the hardcore DeFi expert of the team. And then he, with this other guy here, Joe, they run another uh, YouTube channel, Skid Gr Squid Grow YouTube channel. This one I am familiar with. 32,000 subscribers. That's a lot. It's more than I have. 160 total videos. They're getting some real good traction on these videos right here. The name, not too big of the name. It just sounds like uh, Squid Game, which turned into a rug pull, that token. But uh, it's catchy, though. Squid Grow. Squid Grow. But yes, yeah, so this is a pretty big channel right here. So these two guys, one of them uh, is the guy who does the videos. The other guy puts them together. He does the AMAs. So they know they know the influencer market, they know marketing. That's what I like. That is what I like. Now there's a big let's go here, there's a big white paper right here, which let's click on the link right here. It's a team. Click out of that, click out of that, click out of that. So yeah, white paper. Superman theme. I like it. So to kind of summarize this right here, so there's two main features this project. There is the NFT launch, which is happening today, August 10th, and then there's the private sale, which is happening around two and a half weeks on August 31st. And this is where it gets a little bit complicated. Both these things are tying in with something called Pulse. So Pulse is the trading bot element of this project. Pulse is a network of algorithmic trading bots that are fueled by trading pools funded by investors and crypto companies. So basically, Pulse is an AI trading bot that the company uses to run on their own and just trade on their own, and that generates fees and profits. Now, a portion of the money raised for people buying the NFTs, so they're Superman NFTs that this project is selling. You have to buy those. A portion of the money raised from that goes into running the, tra the Pulse trading bots. It costs money to run those. Now, if you buy an NFT and you hold it, you stake it, you earn a dividend. The dividend is paid out in Superman tokens. That's a tradable token that's going to be on exchanges. But then to get to pay those dividends, to pay the passive income, the staking fees, and that comes from the pulse fees generous. So that's kind of a lot of information. It's a lot to digest. Basically, we got to know is pulse is their AI trading bot element. Trading bots are very big right now. So you, it's always a bonus to have a trading bot element into a project. And it is an AI project again. And then basically NFTs, there's one main NFT. It's the Superman NFT. You'll get into more details on that. You have to buy that. Then you can stake it. You earn a fee. And then the fees come from the revenue that the company is making by running their trading bots, which costs money for other people to use. Now, if you buy one NFT, one Superman NFT, that gets you access to the pre-sale, but nothing part of this private group here. 
if you buy two NFTs, you get access to the pre-sale or the private sale, we call it. And you also get access to this private group. So in the private group, they give out calls. They talk about other totally unrelated meme coins that they think are going to moon. They'll give out price predictions, that sort of stuff. So it kind of just gives you access to their calls right there. Uh, you know, they're just calls. Uh, some are successful, some aren't. But it just gives you kind of more trading intel, what the team is buying, what they're looking at, etc. So you need to buy two NFTs to get access to the group. One NFT, it just gets you access to the pre-sale, but not the group. Two, you get the pre-sale and the group. Then the pre-sale slash private sale will launch on August 31st, and it's the same rate. It's going to be $1 per token for both the pre-sale and the private sale. What else? So let's look more at the Superman NFTs. So it's $150, uh, $150 per NFT. There's a thousand total Superman NFTs. Now the goal, the staking goal is they haven't really given out a, a specific percentage yield. You're looking for their goal is to have a 3x annual return. It's obviously a lot, nothing set in stone, nothing guaranteed. But if the project has long-term success, then that is what you'll be looking at, hopefully a 3x annual return. But you know, again, nothing set in stone. Then additionally, if you own a Superman NFT, so it's a thousand of those, cost $150. They will, you will also be entered into a lottery where they will give out three golden Superman NFTs. That's the premium NFT model. There's only three of those. 750 value, you'll be entered into that lottery and you could win that, which is basically like winning $750. Now, if you go to the website, see so here's the link right here, NFTs. It's on the Sidekick uh, Finance. You have to connect your wallet if you're interested in buying. They're not going to do that. Connect, etc. You can mint them there. $150 again at BUSD, or they might have other payment options as well. So there's the link right there. So what's else about this project? So 2% buy tax, 2% sell tax. That's pretty good. The days of 5% are over. The days of 0% are also over for the most part. Every project's about 1% or 2%. So that's good. Buy and sell taxes will go to buy and burn. That means they will buy their token back on the open market with the hopes of raising the price of it. The Superman token will also go into marketing and development expenses costs. That's pretty standard for buy and sell taxes. Here we have the tokenomics. So the pre-sale and the private sale to uh, that is about one half the total supply right there, about 55%. Uniswap trading bombs, it will start trading at Uniswap after the pre-sale that starts August 31st. It's not through a launch pad, I don't think, or if it is, they haven't announced it yet, but it might be on their website. This comes through trusted sources here. Otherwise, I would never promote a private sale that wasn't through trusted sources that didn't go through a launch pad. So the Uniswap uh, liquidity lock, that'll be about one-sixth total token supply. Centralized exchanges, that'll be about 12% of the total token supply. It costs money to get on those. There's a team supply right there, 20 million tokens. Influencers, you know, they're influencers themselves. I'm an influencer. I'm, you need to have marketing. You need to have influencers. I'm glad they're paying a lot of attention to that. They're also going to have a lot of gamification and giveaways. And then as mentioned, the price for the private sale and the pre-sale is $1 a token, same price. Also at launch, you can get it for $1. And in the future, they're going to be doing a, launching a launch pad for future projects that kind of tie in with the scene. They're going to be more influencer focused as well. So any project that really wants to utilize heavy marketing through influencer channels, since these guys are influencers are connected with a bunch, those are the projects they are going to focus on that will be more so along the lines let's go into the roadmap right now simple three phases right here website that was just developed uh, this week the nfts just launched today and then coin market cap coin gecko listings that should be pretty soon you know whenever this coin launches then the launch so that's you know be right after the pre-sale around august 31st some YouTube videos, multiple calls. I'm in one of those. So right now we're in phase one. It looks like it will be going for around the next three to four weeks. Phase two, they want to be trending on Dex tools, trending on CoinMarketCap, more YouTube videos, some huge YouTubers. And then phase three, get some centralized exchange listings, buy back and burn, get the launch pad, get that launched, et cetera. And that's it for Superman Finance. So the links will be at the bottom. Always do your own due diligence and remember that new projects like this are higher risk, but also high reward. So what do I like about this one? Well, I like a few things. Number one, I like the character it's based on. Superman, obviously, he's the biggest superhero of all time and he's very memeable. He's always flying or he's always putting out fires. 
you know, Superman flying past the moon, that's just like a coin mooning or him putting out a fire. That's like a token burn. So you got to have memes for the Twitter game. And this coin definitely does. What else do I like? Team looks very competent. They are docs. They've done this before. One of the team members, I don't know if I mentioned this before, one of the team members has started three projects before, three meme coins with increasing levels of success. The last one was uh, very successful. It did multiple X. I don't know exactly how much, but they definitely have experience. So that is good. Number two, I like how they're taking their time at the launch. They're taking a good three weeks before the pre-sale. So, you know, you need time to do AMAs, which they've won AMA schedule today. They did an AMA yesterday. Then it gives them time to do more, put more, uh, more YouTubers on board. Too many teams are rushing to launch in like three or four days. You got to build up hype, and it generally takes a few weeks. So this team definitely has the launch game down. Anyways, that's it for this coin. So drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think about Superman Finance. Hit the like button if you haven't already. Be back tomorrow with a new video. Ben Crypto signing out. Catch you later.